Hi friends. Today in this video we will learn how to update a contact in Company Hub. So basically, first what I need to do is I need to search for that contact in Company Hub based on that email I have. Then I will add a condition that says if the ID exists, you know, after the search is run, you will find an ID here. So the filter should be if this id exists then you will update the record which is you know table name will be contact this record id you will copy from field and will be achieved from this contact found and then you can use uh, first name last name you can always split using the modified data i'll come back to it later and if this id does not exist then an in an else we'll say add another wrap and we'll say create contact so let's see how do we arrive at this step we are on the home page explore and automate we select the two apps suppose first app is sheets okay and the other app is company hub now i say when a row is created in company hub okay i will say update a record in company hub because that is my first condition as in the first step i want so we'll click on this we'll say go and we'll say yes i'll add my con connections here okay what i did was after my trigger i said add another app came here company hub i'll say create search contact and after this here i will map the email from here just a minute okay so now i'll say here is the email run the test now we'll say you need to check condition now i will say in this contact found if the id exists update record the table name will be contact the record id will be copy from field and it will be the one found so we will go for id for first name you can say modified data uh, we are going to use this field you can see first name and last name is combined so we'll use a modifier extract text still a particular character text will be name character here is a space i have clicked on space i say don't include apply validate and save similarly for last name modified data use modifier this time is going to be after a particular character text same field same character is space inclusion don't apply validate and save for email you can pick from the first one uh, here or here whatever suits you you can go anyhow okay and i'll just map the fields i want to update okay and i'll say run the test successful now what if it does not exist so i want it to create a new one so else minimize i'll say add another app scroll down Say company hub. Do this. Create contact. Add connection. Just like the previous steps, I'll do. Now the rest of the fields you can map according to your requirement. Simple. At the end, what I do is test. Okay, this is duplicate because we already tested, and this record was found here, so it will say duplicate. So what should we do is to go to the trigger app okay in this sheets make a new entry one that does not exist okay then click on refresh data minimize come back again you will find a new email here okay and then you can test 